Here's the thing. Stay with me for one second. My boyfriend and I have a podcast called the Jenna and Julian podcast, and I realized that Julian is terrible at celebrity trivia. He has no idea who anyone is. One of the questions I asked him was about Cher. By the way, he thinks that Cher, Shakira, and Celine Dion all have the same voice. He also thinks that Anne Hathaway, Julia Roberts, and Sandra Bullock are the same person. But he literally said to me, I know who Cher is. She's from the movie Stuck on You. And then he went on to relentlessly make fun of me because I had never seen the movie Stuck on You because it's trash and garbage and why would I have ever seen it? So we watched it recently and yeah, they're just two people stuck together. It's a trash movie and he thinks it's like a cinematic masterpiece. It did get me thinking though. Like, to be stuck to another person, hmm. But for dogs to be stuck to each other, oh my, I'm gonna make stuck on you for dogs. And I know you've seen the title of this video and you're thinking, but you only have three dogs. Wrong. This is my mom's dog. Her name is Gildy, which my mom is convinced means like celebration or something in like Norwegian, which I think she just made up. Four dogs. I wanna make a quadruple dog sweater. Now I looked for it on the internet. It doesn't exist. Probably for a good reason, because it seems kind of wrong. But maybe that's my purpose in life, is to just have dogs with me, and this is like their purgatory, or like version of hell. You're sentenced to life, living in my house, where I do things out of love, but that are questionable. But like, love you way too much. I also realized that I've been doing a lot of crafting and DIY videos. Guess what? Watch out, kids, because when you turn 30, all you're gonna wanna do is craft. I feel like the only way for me to properly express my emotions is to just sit down and do something very tactile, which includes laughter, which means I'm gonna be making a quadruple dog sweater today. Welcome to my channel. So I got to thinking, how am I gonna do this? I wanna do it all the way out and not in a practical way. Like they're not gonna be able to go to the bathroom in this. This is like a five minute wearing thing and then you have to take it off though. They're not gonna really be able to do anything, but I want it to exist. Like the human centipede for dogs, but they're not all facing in one direction, they're all facing the same way. Are you on board with me? So if you make like a sack and then you tie them all in it and you cut holes for the, stay with me, for their head and their arms and their tail, then you can have a quad dog like sweater. This is minion fleece, which I felt was appropriate. But then I was like, well, what if there's not enough give in here? You know, marbles is a lot smaller than the rest of them. So I also got a stretch fabric in Galaxy because this is the internet. And then I also have a last resort, which I'm hoping I don't have to get to. We'll get there when we get there, but here we go. I'm going to attempt for the first time that I'm aware of on the internet, quadruple dog sweater. Say a prayer for my dogs. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. They are so tolerant of my fucking bullshit. All right, here we go. All right, so don't worry. I got three yards of minion fabric. So there'll probably be some 